good morning folks it is Saturday morning about 730 and we're just getting rolling out of camp and back onto the highway so yeah it was a nice evening it rained on us a little bit in the night and other than that though it was it was beautiful all sorts of animal life like wandering around have no idea I didn't really look I slept pretty good I just heard it you know tend to hear what's going on wake up listen for a minute go back to sleep anyway beautiful day see you later So I've got to make about 500, 510 miles today, which means probably won't film a whole lot because it's about nine hours of driving. With that being said, let's get this journey going, right? Hey there folks, it's been a while since I've talked to the camera. I uh, woke up this morning in Oregon, right on the Oregon-Idaho border, and I've just pressed really hard to get across the state of Idaho and through a corner of Utah and into, uh, let's call it Southwest Wyoming. We're actually quite a ways into Wyoming, so not exactly west. That being said, we just turned off and headed up into the Wasatch National Forest. Those mountains you can see behind me are the um, Umtia mountain range. And can't get a whole lot closer. As you can tell in the background, we're starting to get to the snow. We can probably get up another maybe thousand feet. We're sitting just shy of like 10,000 feet right here though. So it's already melted out pretty good. Absolutely gorgeous country. So. I am going to drive around a little bit. I found several campsites. In fact, there's a developed campground that I can see from here next to a lake. Not a soul in it, so maybe we'll camp there tonight. Might be nice to have some amenities. Um, that being said, let's get back on the road. I want to see some more of this train. It's gorgeous. So I misspoke a little bit earlier, I will try to remember to edit the video, but in case I did forget, those aren't the Umtia Mountains, those would be in Oregon. These are the Uinta Mountains. You can see where I got confused for a moment. I knew the name of it, I just I couldn't pull it out of the top of my head. So Uinta Mountains, Wasatch National Forest, it's almost six. I'm going to start looping my way back down to that campground I found down below about a thousand feet. And we'll spend the night there on the side of a lake. Awesome. Good luck on campsites this time. There's tonight's campsite. A little bit of a muddy jeep.
Just out walking around, walking the roadway here. Figured I'd come and see what kind of neighbors I've got. Um, there's not another human being up here, but there are a lot of animals, right? And I figure it's early enough in the year, we're close enough to the snow line that we should probably make sure there's not bear activity around camp. Um, it's the Rocky Mountains after all, and they'd be grizzlies. So far, no sign of bear. Found some bobcat tracks, some really weird massive bird tracks. I don't know what they're to, but... And probably 500 bajillion deer and elk tracks. Like, they are everywhere. Kind of hoping I see one. I'm just going to kind of keep taking this route up and down the road throughout the evening. Because there's a lot of open, clear areas. See if we can't get us an elk on film. That'd be awesome. Early in the year, so probably won't have antlers, but still be awesome right I thought so let's keep exploring I'm gonna try and stock up in it on it but dead center in your screen is whatever the bird is that is making those huge tracks you should have just seen its head lift if you look right there off the tip of my finger you can see it in that clump of bushes and it keeps looking up at me See if we can get a little closer. It's gotta be a crane or a heron of some kind. I just can't quite tell. Excuse this shot if it doesn't turn out. It's dark, needed the flash. Not quite dark, but getting very close. Anyway, just wanted to sign off and say goodnight to folks. Beautiful campsite, absolutely peaceful. I have not seen a person for, I don't know what time it is, but let's say roughly seven hours. Um, totally alone up here, which is kind of amazing. And beyond that, it's just absolutely beautiful. Also got some nice sunset pieces. I'll show you those. With that being said, thank you for watching. See you on the next leg.